Have you ever had a prospect, a deal just disappear, like these people went into the witness protection program? Well, guess whose fault that really is? Let's discuss that for a moment. I had a client call me today. He said, Claude, I worked out a deal with somebody. Uh, we worked out all the terms and everything like that. And we were supposed to get together the next day and that person couldn't be reached. Uh, I had a strong commitment, everything I needed except a written contract and maybe some monetary consideration. And I called this person, I left voicemails. This went on for two weeks. And then finally they got back to me and said, You're, this won't shock you, will it? Uh, they've changed their mind. Now whose fault is this? When I spoke to this person, he said, oh, these people are this and that, they lied to me, they manipulated me. You as the professional, if you're a gut salesperson, you have to anticipate things like this happen. I sound real smart right now, but you know what? I've made the same mistakes myself, and maybe you have too. Or if you haven't, I'd love for you to avoid it. When you're negotiating with somebody and you have that meeting of the minds, as we say in legalese, make sure you have a commitment. Make sure there's some money paid up front. First thing is, in real estate or any business, get it in writing. Send them a DocuSign, send a contract, send some kind of agreement, get a signature. If it's truly an exchange of a property, make sure it's notarized also, okay, or witnessed at the least. Second, if you're doing any kind of deal, a service uh, or property, make sure you get some skin in the game. That means they give you some money. Either they pay you in full or they, get, um, you, they give you some kind of token consideration up front, a credit card, a wire transfer, a PayPal, something up front. That'll guarantee that they get back to you if they have some money up front. Even if it's a small amount, a very small amount, that's an insurance for you that you're gonna get that phone call and they're not gonna disappear on you. Third, um, what you want to do is always get a commitment for us. Get the information you need from these people. Make sure you have the cell phone number, the mail address, the um, email address, everything you need. So if something does go wrong, you can follow up, you can communicate with people. And finally, what you want to do is when you're speaking to somebody, um, make sure you set a secondary hard appointment. You've seen me do this in several um, of my uh, videos before. Uh, Mr. and Mrs. Prospect, this is great. I'm gonna send you this information. I'd like to speak with you um, to later today at 4.30. Does that work for you? I'm gonna change my schedule. I'm gonna work my schedule so we can speak specifically on video. Video is important. If you've watched my other videos, always try to go from an audio or a cell phone call to a video call. Why? Common sense. You know, when you have that face to face, you have a lot more. Everybody's got a lot more invested when you're face to face with somebody. It's just a great psychological um, trigger. Okay, um, this is where you get people's when they make commitments. You're getting it written in stone. Okay, so take these steps that I just reviewed and make sure you're when you're doing a deal. I mean, that break. I've done deals with people. They said, "Yes, Claude, this is great," and you're on that little bitty honeymoon, and then you can't find them. Um, that's a heartbreaker, right? Because in your mind, you spent that money already, didn't you? Don't tell me you didn't, because I know I have. Don't let your prospects go on the witness protection program. Don't let them disappear on you. Take these few steps here, and this will ensure that you have a greater likelihood of uh, consummating, a, I love that word, consummating. Uh, that's a $10 word right there. Consummating the deal, and uh, you go to the bank, and you get rewarded for your hard work. This is Claude Diamond. Uh, with another gut sales tip, I do answer my own phone, 970-281-5151. If you enjoy these videos, help motivate me. Share these with your friends. Give me a thumbs up. Uh, hit the subscribe and the little bell button. And remember the most important thing. I know how hard you work, and I know how well-meaning you are. You don't need the jets. I see all these gurus. They got to show off their damn watches and their fancy cars and everything like that. You know what? We're normal people. We just, we just want a roof over our head. We want to pay our bills. We want to take care of our family and our responsibilities and have some good lobster mac and cheese. I'm not saying uh, mac and cheese anymore. I'm saying lobster mac and cheese on our table. We want to live a good life in this great American culture. And you know what? Nobody deserves success more than you. I really mean that. Take care. Be safe.